Gear up for the new season with a new Kia from Luther Kia of Bloomington. Right off the bat, Kia of Bloomington has over 100 new Kias, plus more coming every day. Swing away with Sorento, Sportage, or Telluride. Visit us in Bloomington or at LutherKiaofBloomington.com. Welcome into this Twins final pitch presented by Luther Kia of Bloomington. Tim Laudner, Katie Storm with you. Minnesota was looking for the win in this series finale out at Fenway Park, but they unfortunately come up short. They lose their starting pitcher early, unfortunately, and the bats really break out for Boston in that third inning. It was hard to get back in this one. Yeah, Katie, the things, they knew, the Minnesota Twins knew that this was going to be a tough road trip going into a couple of hostile environments, Yankee Stadium and Fenway Park in Boston. And both of them were hostile environments. And so all in all, not a bad road trip for the Minnesota Twins. Uh, yeah, they would have liked to come home four and three, had a nice plane ride home. They can still have a nice plane ride home because the Twins continue to pitch the ball very well and catch the ball very well. Uh, iron out a few things offensively and start a nice homestand uh, coming up and uh, just continue to play Good, solid baseball. That's what the Twins have in mind right now. There were some bright spots in this series and in this game here today. Max Kepler had a solid series with four hits, a home run, and two RBI. Willie Castro went two for four today with a huge homer for Minnesota. But once again, it just wasn't enough as they fell 11-5. to five. Kenta Maeda took a tough hit off the leg early in that second inning. And here's what Rocco Baldelli had to say after the game about that. He got hit squarely. Um, you're really hoping not to get a really bad result, like a broken ankle or something like that. Um, it was we were fearful, to be honest, watching him on the, on the ground out there. But um, as he got up and the initial pain went away, uh, he was able to stand and move around. So that was positive. The X-rays were negative. Um, he's got some swelling already. Uh, we'll figure out. I think probably tonight, tomorrow, just where he's at. Um, how he's moving around. So we're not going to make any judgments at the moment, but uh, lucky to avoid a, a major injury. So that's a little bit of a positive sign for Kenta Maeda. We hope to see him back out on the mound soon. Some positives the Twins can take home from this seven-game road trip as they head back to Target Field to open up a 10-game homestand tomorrow, beginning with the Washington Nationals. Tyler Malley on the mound looking to get Minnesota back on track. As far as today, thank you so much for joining us here for this Twins final pitch presented by Luther Kia of Bloomington.